Okay, so this one's gonna be fun. Uh, as I was recording the course today, I found a stolen pin on Pinterest. So instead of just reporting it, I thought, you know what, let me put this in the course so I can show you exactly how to make a stolen pin go away and how to report it. So here is the stolen pin, okay? This guy took off my logo at the bottom and he is, believe it or not, you're gonna love this one, uh, here. I'll show you what he's selling with my pin. He is selling how to take your Pinterest traffic to the next level with a Pinterest book. And I wonder if somewhere in this Pinterest book, he teaches you to steal pins from other users on Pinterest. Um, anyway, so I'm going to report this because this is my image and I can show you how in a bunch of different ways. Uh, it's right here on Google search. It is also the featured image in the blog post that I wrote about this. Um, it's very clear that this is my pin. <laughs> so what we're gonna do is we're gonna go over to, and yeah, here it is on my blog too. I mean, it's everywhere. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna click this little button and we're gonna report the pin, okay? So this is my property. It's copyrighted and it infringes on my copyright. So I'm not gonna fill all this out because, um, you know, I don't want everybody having my address and stuff. But uh, so what I'm gonna do is I, this is my image. I am going to copy the blog post address directly from my blog so they can go see it. And then I'm going to say I created this image in Canva for my blog post and pin. It has my logo on it. He removed it and is using my image without permission to sell a book. Okay. So this is the pin, it fills it in for you. I want to remove all, I don't know what this strike thing is. Oh no, I want to strike. Yeah, strike. <laughs> I'm irritated. Uh, okay, and so this is accurate. I have good faith belief that it is not owned by that person. I state under the penalty of, of perjury that this is my image and my name is Jennifer Tokenyuk. Whoops. Jen Tokenyuk, digital CEO. I wonder if I have to be digital CEO. Let's find out. Digital CEO, Jen Tokenyuk. And it does match my name. Oh, that's why up here. We have to change this, so. And again, I will put in all this stuff, but then I will put in the rest of it in a minute. So uh, what'll happen is I will put this through, they will remove it, and they will let me know what happens with that. Um, and that is how you file a complaint. Now. One thing to note is that sometimes we do pin to Pinterest without adding the image to our blog. You can still prove that it's your image doing exactly the same thing, but it is much easier <laughs> when it's blatantly on your blog and, and that they can tell it's been stolen. So usually having your logo in the same place on all your pins and then showing them, look, they just cropped out my logo, uh, it's, pretty blatant that it's yours. So hopefully, I mean, I, I'm not even gonna say hopefully this won't happen to you because it absolutely will. Um, the reason that I even found this pin in the first place was because I was recording a lesson on relationship between, um, you know, pins being uh, related to your boards. And so for example, let's go to I think I found it on the Pinterest board as I was doing that one. So let's see here. Everything's all out of order right now. I must have moved a board around. Okay. So when I went to the more ideas tab, this is where I found it. 
it showed me my own pin and I went, wait a minute, that's kind of weird. So um, anyway, I'll be checking that a little bit more often now and I highly recommend the same, but you're gonna find stolen pins. Um, at first I was kind of like, oh, I was so mad, but then I was kind of honored that someone would even bother to steal my pin. It must've been a good one. Um, but at the same time, strike, delete, report, move on. <laughs>